Three brand new Tesla Roadsters uncovered in China. If you missed out on buying and owning an original Tesla Roadster, now might be your chance to rectify that regret three times over. Three original Roadsters have been found sitting in shipping containers in China and are now for sale. The trio has been sitting at a port since 2010 after being abandoned, racking up storage charges ever since, which the seller is paying. Two of the Og Roadsters are the sport model, one in radiant red and the other in very orange, while the third is a very orange base model. Some details about the Roadster's powertrains remain a mystery, as Gruber Motor Company says it won't know the state of the battery packs and other information until the cars return to the U.S. The company plans to ship them to America in mid-May unless someone buys them before then. Once the cars are in Gruber Motors' possession, the company will complete a full technical review of the three Roadster models. The company does not know if the service plugs were pulled from the energy storage system before shipment nor the car's actual mileage, which it lists as zero for all three while labeling them as bricked. The low-quality photos with better ones coming are like a peek back in time, showing off three pristine-looking Roadster models. The cars look new, with images revealing two cars with paper floor mats like those a dealer would place to protect the real ones. Another one still has its plastic covering on the passenger seat. It's doubtful the cars have been driven many miles, if any at all, judging by the pictures. The seller is accepting bids right now for the three Tesla cars, and is willing to fly to China to meet any prospective buyers. The seller is offering them together as a package. However, they are open to splitting the trio. Each of the three roadsters has unopened boxes in the trunk that the company assumes are the charging cables. Each also comes with a larger external box that Gruber believes is the hard top and carrying case. Source. Reposted and summarized from Anthony Alanis at Inside EVS.